Thanks for all those tweets during 2020 overnight. So many of you relieved to see Ethan smile, that little boy rescued from the bunker. But tonight I wanted to tell you about one man everyone in that town was talking about. It's hardly the bad guy. This guy was the hero. Midland City, Alabama, a town that relies on prayer. January afternoon, a town that would also rely on a school bus driver, a quiet man named Chuck Poland, who called the school children on his bus his kids. He was driving that day, flagged down by a man who lived along the route, Jimmy Lee Dykes, who demanded children from the bus. When the driver tried to stop him, tried to put that bus in reverse, he was shot and killed. We all know now what happened next. Little Ethan stolen from the front seat, six days trapped in that bunker. Last night here, those first images of Ethan, an ABC News exclusive. The family telling us they were hoping we would show America that Ethan's smile had returned. But that community knows it will never get that bus driver back. And there was something we heard over and over again. There's a long line of heroes, and I don't use that, that word lightly. But I can also tell you that, that Mr. Poland, the bus driver, is a hero. This could have been so much worse. I have no doubt that uh, his actions likely saved those children being harmed. And from Ethan's family, for the first time talking to us, a thank you to the bus driver who always saved that front seat for Ethan. What you make of the bus driver, who the, all those kids that were still on the bus, and the fact that he... The man is a hero. The man is a hero in this community. We also learned from the neighbors in Midland City about a daily ritual. After that bus route, Mr. Poland would go home, and what would he talk about with his wife? They'd sit on the porch, and he would tell her about his kids. The kids on the bus. Yes. The town now remembering Mr. Poland. They plan to name a baseball field, a stretch of highway in his name. And tonight, perhaps the town pastor putting it best. I think the you nation has learned to love a man that they didn't know. Because of what he did for them, you know, I felt like it didn't matter how many kids were on that bus, he was going to do everything he could to protect them. Yeah. And, and he did. He did. He did.